all of Kate Middleton's maternity looks from her third pregnancy. See everything the Duchess of Cambridge has been wearing, while we wait for the arrival of Royal Baby No. 3. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge announced that Royal Baby No. 3 was on the way in September. Fans of Kate's style follow her every fashionable move and mums to be clamor to copy her maternity looks. See all of the Duchess outfits from her third pregnancy, as we count down to the day we meet the new prince or princess. Kate changed into more casual pieces to visit Tassin Villa Football Club, 22nd of November, wearing her red perfect moment mini duvet jacket with a black turtleneck and jeans, and her new balance trainers. During her visit to Birmingham, 22nd of November, Kate rewore her goat Washington coat from her second pregnancy with Princess Charlotte in 2014, with new boots from Russell and Bromley. She accessorized with her Kiki McDonough Laura earrings and Mulberry Bay's water clutch. To attend Queen Elizabeth II's and Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh's 70th wedding anniversary, November 20th. Kate wore her Diane von Furstenberg Zarita black lace gown with borrowed jewelry from the Queen and Princess Diana, the four-row Japanese pearl choker and the Collingwood pearl and diamond earrings. To visit the Hornsey Road Children's Centre in North London, November 14, Kate Ray wore her cream white goat red grave coat from her first pregnancy with Prince George. She teamed it with her Stuart Weitzman Hafenhof boots her black Mulberry Bay's water clutch bag and her Kiki McDonough hoops with Anishka pearl drop earrings. To observe Remembrance Sunday service at the Cenotaph Memorial, on November 12, Kate donned a new black Dolce & Gabbana coat with double button detailing. She teamed it with a matching hat from Philip Tracy, her Oscar de Laurenta pearl sun star earrings and Emmy London's Natasha clutch bag. Kate attended the annual Royal Festival of Remembrance on November 11, wearing a black Catherine Walker Caressa coat, with black court shoes, her vintage beaded Majid clutch bag and Princess Diana's Collingwood pearl and diamond earrings. For the place to be school leaders forum on November 8, the Duchess stepped out in a new burgundy Eloise tunic dress from Goat, she teamed it with her black Tides pumps her Mulberry Bay's water clutch bag and Mappin and Webb diamond earrings. For the Aft Gala on November 7, Kate recycled her black lace Diane von Furstenberg gown from the 2014 Royal Variety performance. She also sported a new bracelet from Her Majesty, the diamond caterfoil, as well diamond drop earrings we've seen on her before. Kate visited the Lawn Tennis Association on October 31, wearing Play Brave's Clarice jacket over a wide polo top with her Monroe London tuxedo track pants and Nike Air Vapormax flyknit trainers. Gate attended the core coach apprentice's graduation ceremony at the London Stadium on 18th of October, wearing a blue philosophy blazer over a black roll neck with skinny jeans and Russell and Bromley's Fallon dry ankle boots. Kate surprised children at a charity event at Paddington Station on October 16, 2017, dressed in a peach and black Orla Keeley dress with black courts and a matching clutch bag. For her first public appearance, since announcing her pregnancy, Kate wore Temperley London's Eclipse lace collared dress in iris, with giant Vito Rossi pumps, her Mulberry Bay's water clutch bag and Kiki McDonough Eden earrings. On her last public appearance, before Kensington Palace announced her third pregnancy on 4th of September, Kate wore a silk-printed Prada midi dress and L.K. Bennett fern heels to pay tribute to Princess Diana on the eve of the 20th anniversary of her death. 